can't wait to, to beat all these guys. You know, now I'm not gonna talk because last time I didn't talk and I ended up winning. So I'm gonna keep it low key today. You got Sean walking in like McGregor from Top Golf because he actually golfs. <laughs> He's Irish too, so. <laughs> How are you? How are you? How you doing? Good, Welcome good. Hey, Top Golf. He looks like uh, Doug from The Hangover. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're vlogging this though, brother. Pictures? Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing, guys? Light on the hill, we got too many people up in here. We brought nothing in this world, so we can't leave. We got Joe teaching uh, young M. How to golf because M thinks he's left handed. Kind of sore, guys. I'm wearing a size medium, you know what I mean? People make fun of me, but it's just the way it looks on me. <laughs> All right, they make fun of you for the way it looks on me. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Thank you very much. Have a good shot. Hey! Score. Hey! Right here. Look at Sean, the professional golfer. Oh, okay, Sean. Okay, Sean. Damn. Oh, oh. Oh, okay, M. Joe Morgan out here <laughs> teaching us how to do it. Now he's, now he's got me on tape. I'm gonna uh oh. <laughs> oh, and he shanks it to the right. <laughs> That's on tape, buddy. <laughs> he puts me on tape. I'm messing up. That's, it's all right. It's all right. And it goes right again. Joe Morgan, the legend. Oh, oh, oh. Give me some orange juice, y'all. Orange. <laughs> like, so we're playing like, golf. Just curious. E man. M. M right there. Playing golf. And we're doing NBA season projections, okay? I'm gonna let Joe give you guys his season predictions right now. So let us know what you think and how you think the Kings will do. This upcoming season. 24 wins plus or minus a two. Tw 24 wins plus or minus a two, right? Yeah. Why so though? 22 to 26. They got young guys. They got no chance at actually winning. They're they're not about that though. They're about getting minutes to the guys who need it. They're about growing the kids who need it. Uh, people seem mad about some of the contracts and stuff, and you're like, they're all friendly contracts you can get rid of if these kids are amazing. Like it's, I don't know. It's a, it's, a, it's a good year for growth, but don't be mad when you buy a ticket and you lose that day. Like, don't be don't be <laughs> mad when you watch a loss. Be don't watch for the points though. Watch for the effort these young guys are putting out. Watch and, for the Jack Cooley to come out and each one of them. Oh, uh, okay. And who do you think will be the best rookie this year? All right now, this is all on record. Okay. Hold on though. Are you talking like points? Are you talking Just development from A to B? Overall season. So, so the the best, as in the guy you draft first next year. No, no. Well, no. De'Aaron Fox, Bogdan. No, no. I, but uh, I meant, but I meant, if you got yeah. to start over, yeah. the guy that would be the number one, pick, um, and only on the Kings, right? Yeah. I really hope it's De'Aaron, but I don't think it's going to be. Bogdan. I, I, well, yeah, and I hate to call him a rookie, but yeah, like. He's not a rookie. Yeah. <laughs> so best rookie, yeah, he's gonna be it, but that's kind of unfair. It's like you know. It's like saying my stock Ferrari is racing your Honda and I wonder why it won. Well, because it's been doing it a while, you know, like that's not. There it is, guys. Joe thinks the Kings will win. 24, 24 wins? Yeah, 24 plus or minus 2. Plus or minus 2. <laughs> and no. even that, I might just only say minus. <laughs> <laughs> and he's not even drinking orange juice yet, okay? No, it's, they'll be the third worst team in the NBA. And, he, and he's not even drinking orange juice the yet. behind them will be Atlanta and LA. I didn't not even drinking the orange juice yet, but okay. E, uh, e, savage. <laughs> uh, projections and uh, for for the Kings wins record? record wise, yeah. 
I'm thinking 28. 28 wins. 28 wins? Yeah. <laughs> I'm up 28 to wins? Okay, and uh, I don't know. If we could do it last season, you know, we took a game off the Warriors. I think we could do that this, this season. And who do you think will be the best rookie overall? Either Fox or Bogdan. I don't know. Guess, though. I, I, I need Bogdan or Fox? Bogdan. Okay, you know, Bogdan. My dark horse candidate on that is, is Giles. If he gets minutes really? and he actually is healthy, the kid has talent. It's just health was the only reason he went as low as he did. Well, man, oh, man, if he isn't hurt, that'll be a fun kid to watch. So that's my dark horse rookie. That's Joe's dark horse, Harry Giles, which I think he'll be in the G League for most of the year. Uh, but that's only health, though, bro. That's not about. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah so I mean, talent wise, he's like, yeah. he's like I mean, insane. If he that he's healthy <laughs> and he comes up. You know, welcome to the bigs, kid. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sean. What are, what is your prediction on the T Wolves total wins for the upcoming season? Forty-five and thirty-seven. Forty-five and thirty-seven. There it is, guys. Squeaking in at a seventh or eighth spot. And what do you, how many games do you think the Kings will win? Mm, 36, 38. Oh, he's going 36, 38. That's a hot take from Sean right there. There it is, guys. <laughs> oh, but I'm going to give my hot take right there. That inspired me, guys. I'm going to say 30 wins. For the Kings this year. I might be a little bit of a homer, but you know what? They're gonna win 30 games with the over and under of two. How about that? <laughs> Plus about and over, minus two. An over of two and under. <laughs> <laughs> there it is, guys. 30 wins is my prediction. How many wins will the Lakers get this upcoming year? Like, what do you don't I don't know. I don't know. 35. 35 wins for the Lakers, okay. What about the Kings? 32. 32, there it is guys. Robert said the Kings will get 32 wins. You guys already know I won out of M and, and, and Robert. Because the other two guys are, are pro golfers. They don't count. But I beat M and Robert. So I'm just, I'm, I'm just the best. <laughs> I'm joking. For real, I won though. Round one's on me, baby. Stack, rough, mental. So how many times have people said, you're the guy from the hangover? About every single night. Oh Five my ten god. Times. In fact, I'm even... with Doctor. Here, I'll show He's you a that. dentist. Can you see that? Let me see, let me see that. You see that? Oh my gosh! There he is. So I'm that guy, and that's him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. It was a pleasure coming to Top Golf for the first time. Stu says hi. Huge shout out to <laughs> Stu, man. Follow him on Twitter right now. Light on the hill, we got too many people up in here. We brought nothing in this world, so we can't leave with it. People acting like this money, give the air you breathe in. Take it deep, repeat, plotting for increase, counting sheep. We sleep, striking out, we keep on missing it. The point, we just want to be the only one or the first, contradicting our beliefs. So we compromise the life we in to get the code. What good is it to gain the world but lose yourself?